guys, this is an entrance video. Today we're doing another tutorial of how to make Knuckles the Echidna. So the blocks you're going to need is block of quartz, lime wool, light gray wool, gray wool, red wool, light gray stained clay, yellow stained clay, red stained clay, pink wool, and later on white stained clay. Yeah, white stained clay. But what you'll first want to do is on the on the show with your the gray wool, a row on the ground, get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yes, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh no, this is getting awfully close to Metal Sonic. Uh, I don't know. Who cares? Skip one block. Then place one gray, and then to the side go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Did I even get that right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. And now come over here on this block right over here. Get out your red stained clay and and go up by two and do one diagonal with the red stained clay and then come over here come back to the side and do one on top of the back and then one to the side go up above that by one two three four so that's one two three four you get something that looks like that okay so now what you want to do get out your light gray wool and go to the side by three so it's one two three then come to the second block we placed in the middle technically and go down by one and go to the side by two and then make kind of a and then get out your quotes block and make kind of one of those sword things and then go to the side by three so that's one two three and go up by one so you make like a gun like it's kind of like a hand, making like a gun or something. And then do a bottom diagonal. And then make it connect to that. And then come back to where we place these two blocks. And and to the side of where we place those two blocks, go by two with your quartz block. And then go, and then get out your yellow stained clay and go up by three. Then two, and then one. You need something that looks like that. And then get out your light gray again, and go by two. So you get something that looks like that. And then next to that light, the light gray wool, place two, um, two red stained clay underneath there. So then what you want to do is just one, two down the row, and then one right next to it. So you get something that looks like that. And then from here to there, just connect it with red wool. Right in the middle of there, at the bottom, put one quartz block right at the bottom. And then just fill all that in with red. You just made, well, not Don made, one of his shoes. So, yeah, congratulations. And then, it would even be more amazing if I could set the time day. Okay, and I set the time day, so that means we're good. Okay, yeah, we're good. Now what you really want to do? Woohoo! We want to do everything. I want to scream out. Okay, <laughs> sorry. Right on this quartz block, get out your lime wool and go up by that quartz block by three. So it's one, two, three. Go to the side by one with your yellow stained clay, and to the side two with your lime stained clay. And then go down until it connects to the ground, and then fill it square in with that. So you should get something that looks like that. And then let me clear weather. We finished. Well, we didn't finish, but now get out your pink stained clay. And right on this lime wool, go up by two with your pink stained clay. And then go on top of it by one with your with your red wool then get out your red stained clay 
and go to the side of all of them three. And just go up by three with your with your what you call it. That's dang clay. Sad. I have to look at the thing. Right on. No, we don't want to do that. Never mind. No, destroy that. Do one row of red wool and then do that. Sorry, I messed up. Now what we want to do right on this red wool, get out your pink stained clay, go on top of that by three. And then go, and then with your, oops, sorry I burped. And then go, and then right here, where we have this, on, then go up by three. With your, actually four, with, on top of your red stained clay. Now what you want to do, is get out your red stained clay and really we <coughs> <coughs> okay good now now what we want to do is where we have this block right here this red wool go up now go to the side one and then go up one and then to the side two and now where we have this this um block here to the side place one place one red rule and one on top now here we have to get out our pink stained clay so do one upside down L with your pink stained clay and then go on top by three I mean just by no just by two hmm hmm no hold on a second Right here on this block, go up by three. I mean, just just by. Wait a second. Hold on a minute. Yeah, just by two. No, we've had so much memories together. Please don't leave me. Oh, sorry. And now what we want to do is do one diagonal with your pink stained clay. And now we're, and then we want to. Uh, um. Hold on a minute. Um, on top of this upside down L, get out your block of quotes. And then where we have these two clay blocks, place one quote right on top. And you can probably see how much I like Sonic. I have all kinds of Sonic tutorials. Sonic the Hedgehog, Super Sonic, Metal Sonic. Yeah, by the way, thanks to Jeff with that um, ice that looks really good and silver over there which the silver tutorial will be coming in a while but it will be coming eventually so now what we want to do is get out your pink stained clay and place one on top of the, the quotes and then to the side by two oh, that's that. yeah by two then go down by three so it's one two three And then bring one in the middle and fill it in like that so you have something that looks like that. But we're not done yet. Ba -ba -ba. What you then want to do, oh no, we technically are done. We'll go off the statue anyway. Now do right at the last here, do one on top and then do one diagonal to the side. Okay, so now we're gonna do something a little bit different. We're gonna. Oh, by the way, we're working on like a stomach right now. We'll get to that next shoe later when we need it. Now what we want to do is uh, get out your your block of quartz and fill in this with quartz block, and then do the same thing, but go one on each side, then go up by one on each side, except on this side do. Like an upside down L and then one on top again. And on this side, you just want to do a diagonal. And you get something that looks like this. Get out your pink stained clay and do one, two, right on top of those two quotes. And then do red right in there. There's something that looks like that. Now, what you want to do is come to here, get out your red wool, and go and make like one of them sword things. Then get out your red stained clay, put one in the center, and put and make an L, just like that. 
Yeah. And then what you want to do is when we have that done, get out your dark gray wool and go down by one and go to the side by one. Ah. And go down by two again and then to the side one. And then go and then underneath this pink stained clay go two down and do one bottom diagonal and do one diagonal with your light gray wool and then go down by three so it's one two three and do another bottom diagonal and do another bottom diagonal but go to the side by two so you get one two and do another top then do another di diagonal then go up by that diagonal by one with your light gray wool and then go on top by two more and then make like kind of like a flag navy thing but then go on top by one at the end and then come over to here and set the weather clear well as I always say you don't have to I do because you might not be on PC or computer like I am so anyways as I was saying you want to do now um um this is so embarrassing oh okay but get out your gray wool and go to the side by one here this bottom thing this bottom block and go down by two and then do another diagonal and go on top by two do a then do two diagonals with the dark gray wool then do another diagonal and then go to the side by one yeah and then underneath these two blocks do light gray wool then underneath these diagonals do light gray wool and then we start making some detail because as because you might already notice this is one of his gloves one of his giant knuckle gloves can I fall on it? No, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, now make an L, but with like a longer, a longer bottom. Don't make, don't do that to make it look like a good L. Just make it look like a bad L. And do an upside down L. And do one top diagonal. And do one up. Make an upside down L, but then go up one. Get out your gray, dark gray wool. And go to the and put one middle middle block in. Why I set time day. Okay, next what you want to do is get out your red stained clay. By the way, this statue is really hard. It's like this is gonna take like a really a long time to make. Like 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 a really long time. So now what you want to do is do. One to this one with your red stained clay to the side of this gray wool, and do a bottom diagonal from it. And on top of that bottom diagonal, go up by two with the red wool, and back to your stained stained clay. Go up by one more on top of that stained clay, and get something that looks like that. Now we have some more detail to add with some. I'm burping a lot today with um your uh what's it called light gray wool so right here where we have um what wait a minute I'm confused just the uh, um, you store those two blocks and and replace them with light gray wool I don't know why I made them that color and then do a bottom and then do an upside down L Replace that with quartz and then do like kind of like a lightning bolt thing. I didn't mean to do that. You get something that looks like that. Now, what you want to do is just fill this whole thing in with uh, um, with quartz block 
and then you have officially made one of the gloves so there you go there's one of the gloves my cat is sitting here right now trying to get me to pet her but I'm not going to he thinks she's the cutest thing in the world well she kind of is except for he's just in a state today usually she will try to kill and bite and scratch anything that comes in her way don't mess with my cat <laughs> it's not really my cat okay so uh, uh, I'm trying to hold in the burp uh, sorry <laughs> I did it again okay now we're gonna have to work on this shoe this bottom shoe here so get out your dark gray wool and go up by this last one by four so that's one two three four and get out your red wool and here no don't do that don't do that that's just like a mistake Sega made now what you want to do is get out your light yellow stained clay and place one well, place three so do a diagonal and go down by that diagonal by two that's how you want to say it then get out your light gray wool and do a bottom an L not a bottom L just an L then do make like a sword thing with the quartz and then do three light gray wool it's one two three and then do another one two three but at the bottom so it overhangs one and um red stained clay and get out your red stained clay and um at these two blocks do one two and then on top again and then at the then at this other block do one one at the top and then do a bottom out and then come back over here and fill this in with two and make do one diagonal underneath the light gray wool and fill this little gap in here with not light gray wool um red stained clay and then fill this little gap in with red stained clay too um the sun is moving i don't like that I hate when the sun moves because like you know it's like trolling you in a video like hey, i'm gonna make it nighttime hey, you know it's gonna happen hey, hey, hey. I hate when it does that. It's like trolling you. I swear the moon has an evil side. So come back to this um red stained red stained clay and do a diagonal with your a bottom diagonal with your quotes from it. And then once you've done that, just fill the whole rest of the shoe in with the red wool. So it's something that looks like this. You're not done with the cool, but well, you're not done with the shoe yet because you have like that uh that green to add. Now what you want to do is bring out lime wool and do. F so come here, go to these two diagonals and do one right next to it, and then bring it all the way here to this yellow stained clay, and then in the middle and then place three in the middle and then two on the edges and oh oh I'm burping a lot today and then uh yeah and yellow yellow stained clay in the middle now get out your red stained clay and on top of this yellow stained clay go three up and three to the side it's something that looks like that and that's when you've made completely made the uh the shoes this may look like knuckles shoes are really big at the moment but it gets better when it when we go on and like we make the head and stuff it gets better and they'll look better and stuff so don't worry it's fine just leave them how it is don't like shrink them to like one block that wouldn't look good at all we just imagine people doing it. Okay, now get out your gray wool and put two on top of the red red clay. 
then um, red stained clay, then do a diagonal from the other, from that side. Go on top of that diagonal by three. So it's one, two, three. And go to the side one. Do a top diagonal and go into the side one. And get out your block of quartz and go to the side one from these two gray wool and go up by that by one and do a diagonal go to the side by one two three four so that's one two three four and skip this block and then place one on and then place one gray wool on top and do one top diagonal And do a bottom diagonal, and from the, and then get out your no, just don't do that. And then get out, you know, to the side by one, and go on top of and make like an L, and then come back down here. No, don't come back down there. Come back up here, and place one at the bottom. Then get out your light gray wool and go down by that by two sets one two. And then go down by that by two through gray wool. That's one, two. And do a bottom diagonal. And do a bottom diagonal and go to the side one. And then get out your block of quartz and make like a weird sword thing again. And then, and then get out your gray wool and put one right there. So you get something that looks something like that now what you want to do is get out your uh, your light oh, I told you the sun just chose you mr. sun get back in your spot but -da. now it's back in the spot that's all the way over there now ha, -ha. now what you want to do is Get out your light gray wool and uh, fill these gaps in, like the bottom gaps in, with um, with um, light gray wool. And this giant gap here, you just fill it in with light gray wool. And then skip a block and make an L, and then make a bottom L with your gray wool. So you make like an upside down L. Why do I call it a bottom L? It's an upside down L. God. Now what you want to do is get out your light gray wool and put it in the middle of these of this light gray wool and dark gray wool and then the rest just no don't do that. Place one underneath that gray wool and then fill everything else in with block quotes so should get something it's like this oops so here you go those are both of knuckles uh, uh gloves complete my cat is rubbing on my desk it's insane it's insanity now we're gonna get out our red wool and fall on the ground. Whee! Everyone wants to do that. And then, no, here's what we actually want to do. So, um, out your red wool and fill these two parts in. These two parts in with red wool. And make an upside down L. And get out your. <sighs> Burping a lot today. And then get out your um red stained clay and make an L. Do a diagonal. Do another diagonal. Go up by that diagonal by one, two, three, four. That's one, two, three, four. And then and then go to the side one and down one. And then skip two blocks and then go to the side by three, but skip those blocks. 
Oh, um, by the way, we're making like the weird hair Knuckles has. Yeah, that's what we're doing. And now skip two blocks and make an L. And put one underneath that L. One block underneath that L. Go to the side one. Go up by that to the side by one, two, three, four. So that's one, two, three, four. Yes, so you do that. Now come over here. Did we finish the glove? Yeah, we finished it, right? I guess no, we didn't. No. We skipped those blocks. Now we skipped these blocks. So where this gray is, do two diagonals. I guess, yeah, two diagonals. And then by where this gray is, do another diagonal so you have like a weird section thing there. And go up by this block by one, two, three. So that's one, two, three. And then go to the side by two. So you make like a box and go up by that box by three. So that's one, two, three. And you've done that. And the weather is chilling me again. And it's just turned dark. And now it's thundering. Awesome! This is what I wanted. This is gonna troll me. Yes. I know, I it was gonna troll me. I had to do it. It's gonna troll me one way or another. Okay. Oh, you can fill this little gap in, by the way, with uh, red wool. Now get out your pink wool, pink stained clay, and um, and kind of outline the diagonals that we did. So one, two, and do another diagonal, and do one on top of that diagonal, and do another diagonal. Go on top of that diagonal by one by three. So that's one, two. Wait a minute. No. What's going on? Is it supposed to be there? No, it isn't. Ah, uh, supposed to be here. Okay, problem solved. We're all better now. Yippies. Now what we want to do? Yeah, we have that. That's done. So on top of this gray wool, do pink stained clay, and do a diagonal, and do one, two, no wait a minute, one, two, one, two, three, four, five blocks on top, so that's one, two, three, four, five, should come in line with that, I should have just said, just bring it up until it comes in line with that, but you know, it's good. And now come back over to where we made this glove. And it's all going to start coming together now. Actually, don't come over there. Oops, I'm sorry, Mr. Glove. We don't need you right now. And get out your... Here's where we're going to start needing white wool. Oh, by the way, you can get rid of your... Your, um... Like, lime wool and stuff. We really don't need that anymore. Yeah, we don't need that. And get out your light gray, light, light, light gray stained clay. It's a tongue twister. Actually, don't do that. Get out your red wool, cause we, cause there's some stuff we need to do before we do that. And completely fill this part in with red wool. And fill this part in with red wool. So you have that done. Next, what we want to do is. Then get out your light gray stained clay. And then until we get to here, and then overlap one using light gray stained clay. Just bring it over and until it overhangs by one block. And do one, two. So then make a box and then go to the side by two, so that's one, two. And do a diagonal and go up by one. 
And here we get our white stained clay out and do one second. One to the side and one on top. And then get out your black wool. Oh, I forgot to tell you that we needed black wool. Yeah. Get out your gray wool for now though. And then do one gray wool, one black wool, one gray wool, and we no longer need some black wool. So we can just re but, uh, Okay, sorry about that. That was really awkward. Ah, I'm really weird today. So now what we need to do, get out your light gray stand clay and do one, two, three, like that, right there, and do one diagonal. Wait a minute. This isn't supposed to be there after all. It's really is supposed to be here. This is so confusing. It's really supposed to be there. Yeah. And do one red stained clay to the side. And go up by one with your light gray stained clay. And then do one white. One of those clay. And do no, don't destroy it, but do one to, but do light gray stained clay to the side of it. It makes it all easier. Next, what we want to do is we're going to be making up the eyes now. You can see how it's kind of coming along. Eh, kind of. That part kind of ruins that. But, you know, it will make sense. It'll make sense. Oh, and by the way, I'm soon going to be making, uh, in, uh, my building tutorials I I will soon be making um what you would call it Amy Rose and Shadow the Hedgehog and oh yeah and Silver they will be coming soon because I need to make them like especially Amy and Shadow why haven't I made them yet I mean like still it just doesn't make sense maybe even Pink Sonic no I'm, I'm not gonna make Pink Sonic It'd be ridiculous. So now, um, get out your quartz block and do one to the side for quartz, and on this white block, go up by two and up and up by one with your light like, stained clay. And I forgot we still need black because of the eyes. Because this is from like the Sonic the Hedgehog, like the old Sonic the Hedgehog, like way back then. So he doesn't really have eye color. So do one black. And then do one gray. On top so you get something like that. Yeah, he doesn't really have eye color. Now get on get out your um red stand clay and do one on top of that. Just like that. And now go to now where we have this block here, this quotes block, go to the side by three with your white stained clay. So it's one, two, three. And then do one with your light gray stained clay. And then do two to the side with your block of quotes. And do an L, but on top of this block right here, do one quotes, one block of quotes. And get out your black wool. That's one. And then get out your gray wool and put out your gray and put your gray on top. Now I promise you, I show you, you are not gonna need black wool again. I promise you, you don't need it. Now what you want to do is get out your block of quotes. Where we have this L here, just go to the side of that L by two. Do one diagonal go up by one and do another diagonal and do a bottom diagonal and go to the side by two and it should come in line with that and then fill that little long L in with with um quotes and now uh, there's actually only one place we need quotes again but you know just keep it because we're still gonna need it that's a good round keep it because we need it oh, sorry I'm really wound okay. Now get um 
get out your red wool and go two to the side where we have this block right here and underneath of that just fill that in and in this little place right here you can just fill entirely that in with white stained clay yeah I hope I said it right white stained clay I'm right yippee so you should have something that looks like that now you probably see how it's turning up to be knuckles if you've ever even seen knuckles the echidna time goes so fast in minecraft i thought time was supposed to be ten minutes it's a two two minutes for ten two i tell you two 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 now get out your um, red wool, actually get out your red stained clay, and where we have this black new one to the side, and then get out your red wool, and clear weather, oh, I hate how the, it see, weather just trolls you, it just trolls you, absolutely trolls you, it's stupid, it's dumb, I'm done, I'm done with Minecraft, goodbye everyone, just kidding, okay, so I'm um, in this middle here, Put in this little middle, put two red wool and do one on top of the quotes and one on top of the clay. So, like in the corners, then get out your pink wool and do two in the middle, one diagonal, one and go up one, then do a diagonal and go to the side one. And then do a diagonal, do another diagonal, do another diagonal, but go to the side by one, and then make an L. Something that looks like that. Now we made like mad Knuckles. Knuckles isn't really happy because he was kicked out of the Sega company, so he's not happy anymore because he's no longer in any Sonic games. Ugh, I'd be mad too if I were Knuckles. He even has his own game. Knuckles Chaotix. <laughs> okay. So technically, we don't do that. No, we do that. That I don't know why I'm saying we don't do that, but we do. Now get out your red sand clay and put one on top of that gray. And put two right there in the middle. So we have that. And then get out and come on where we have this L and go to the side of the L by one with your your um white stained clay and then do one and then to the side one with your pink stained clay and do a bottom diagonal and then do one red stained clay and one the two red stained clay right where this pink stained clay is and then underneath that do one clay you now one gray wool and one red stained clay and you should have something that looks like that yeah now where we have this here get out your red wool put one on top of the red stained clay then get out your gray one on top of the white stained clay you should get something that looks like this now come back down to this glove finally glove you're finally included you so get out your red wool and go on top of this here by one two three four five six so that's one two three four five six yeah, and it's all going good. And then go up by one, two, three, four with your red stained clay. So it's one, two, three, four. And then go up and then come to here and go up by that by one, two, three, four, five. That's one, two, three, four, five. And then go up by that with your red stained clay. And do a diagonal with the red wool. And then go on top of that red wool with the red stained clay. Do one diagonal, one diagonal. 
and then do one diagonal and then one to the side and then with your red wool to go to the side of that by one two three four five six seven so it's one two three four five six seven then go to the side by two with your red stained clay and then go two bottom diagonals with the red stained clay and then do another bottom diagonal but but go down by that diagonal by one and do one red down underneath those two um, those two clay and then do one and then do an L then go down by that L, this little block, here by two, so that's one, two. And do a zipper, or a zipper, what the heck, where do I get a zipper from? And, uh, um, I don't know why I said zipper, that's really awkward. And do one bottom diagonal and go down by that diagonal by one, two, three, four, five, six, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, then do a da bottom diagonal and go down by one with red stained clay, and where we have this gray wool with your red wool, just go on top, by that by two, and then put one red wool here, and leave the blank so now we have made his head we just need to like cover the stuff in his head if you know what I mean no it's just weird no. and then get out the uh, pink stain clay and where we have this right here do one diagonal yeah one top diagonal and then go to the side of that by one with quotes then go by then go to the side by one two with pink stain clay and then go down by that two by one two and then and then skip one block wing it across until it over until it overhangs by one block so you get something that looks like this now we not we we do we, bleh, we do not want to fill this whole thing in with red because there's more detailing but kinda just over here and then we're pretty much done. Just fill it in with the red. So come over here and get out your red stained clay and and fill it up until it goes up to there. And go down from this block by one, two, three. And then go to the side by one. And then yeah, and there you go. And now, guys, now you will want to fill this whole entire thing in with red. And I'll meet you guys there once I've done that. So, guys, this is what you should get when you fill the whole entire thing in with red. I know it looks a little bit weird. Well, bye. I know it looks a little bit weird, but it it's all I really got. It's a good Knuckles. It's from Sonic the Hedgehog 3, I believe. And, um, or Sonic and Knuckles. <laughs> the old games that include Sonic, uh, that include Knuckles, it would be like this. And, yeah. I don't want to look at me like I know I'm right. I know I am. You, you're in Sonic CD. You're an old person, too. You're, you're old, too. You're old. But, but, yeah, I know it's kind of weird, but this statue, I think, is pretty cool. It looks weird with like the blocks I cho chosen and stuff, but at least it looks like knuckles. So yeah, leave a comment down below in the comment section below. Maybe even leave a comment about oh, how the, the sun chose me. Oh, I hate when it does that. Leave a comment down below of what of what more tutorials I should build, and uh, subscribe. Leave a like. Yeah, peace out.